Yo, what's up, peeps? <clears throat> um, <clears throat> not sure exactly what time it is. I'm late. Uh, can sleep, so I'll figure shoot a video. <clears throat> um, let's talk. Let's just done for, <sighs> jump right into it and let's talk free agency with football. The Raiders are supposed to be making moves, doing stuff to to fix their team, and they're not. They're not doing shit, man. And I know free agency just started, but fuck. A lot of good players are already fucking gone, and it's because we don't, we don't have the money, supposedly, to uh, sign anybody. Well, for what they're getting signed for, at least. I mean, Christ's sake, the Kirk Cousins deal was ridiculous. Three years, 80-something million, guaranteed, no matter what, he gets that money. And uh, <laughs> he ain't worth it. I'll tell you right now, he ain't worth it, but whatever, we'll see. Just the money that's going around is just... And the Raiders can't sign nobody because they put up so much money in their offensive line. And in Derek Carr, and their offensive line didn't impress me at all last year. And we lost Danico Autry, we lost... We had, we cut Kerry, because he's, he's going to jail. Or not Kerry, I'm sorry, um... Sean Smith, because he's going to jail. Kerry left him in somewhere else. So our team is actually worse than what it was. <clears throat> so, you know, I don't know what Gruden and, and McKenzie have planned, but, you know. And, and, you know, I guess Jordy Nelson's in town talking to the Raiders. We'll see if, well, what's going to happen with that. Uh... There's just been a lot of moves in the free agency. Um, a lot of big names have already committed to other people. They're gonna sign some contracts, you know. Uh, and the Raiders just really aren't doing anything. And I don't know if it's because they they don't want to, or if it's mostly because of the salary cap issues. And you know, they still gotta sign Mac. They still gotta sign a few other players, and they still haven't signed any free agents. So. We'll see, you know. So, you know, if you follow sports, you're in football especially, uh, there'll be a lot of money moving around in the next couple of weeks. I'm really exhausted. Um, you're probably telling my eyes that, you know, when you can't sleep, you can't sleep. <clears throat> Just being shorthanded at work and pretty much having to do with everything uh, takes a toll on you you know working open to close every day <clears throat> <clears throat> some days I don't get lunch because there's not enough people to go take a lunch you know um, and it's not that I'm hungry it's just it's nice to have that that break away from work to rest and recharge for an hour or half an hour so, got that that I'm dealing with. I mean, the next three days is just me and one other person, so we're not getting no lunch. We're going to be working open and close together. It's just, it's crazy, you know? And, uh,. Not, you know, I guess that's life. That's you, you do what you gotta do. You work what you gotta work. <clears throat> but I'll tell you, it's making me really think about what I'm doing. Because it's just like shit, man. It ain't supposed to be this tough. <clears throat> But at least my daughter was awake today when I came home, so that was kind of cool. I got to feed her dinner and, uh, you know, put her, to, put her to sleep and all that shit. So, it was cool. We kicked it for a little bit. Finally got her to watch, find a movie that she likes to watch besides Moana and fucking Trolls, man. I've seen those movies probably a hundred fucking times each already. <clears throat> so I put on a new one today. 
uh, meet the Robinsons, and she dug it, so cool. I'm down with that. But yeah, that's pretty much it for today. Just a short one. I'm fucking tired. <clears throat> Y'all have a good night. Stay out of trouble. Peace.